Oh man, if I could include you guys in the intro to my streams and the intro to what happened before I started recording this video, I just spent the last hour and a half with all of my beautiful viewers figuring out how to cancel my local shitty Canadian media coverage local TV because I spend about a hundred dollars a month right now to get four BPL matches no like end of the day footy highlights of everything that's happened during the day and stuff like that so my beautiful subscribers just help me sign up I didn't think this was possible to be in sports and now I get La Liga matches Serie A Bundesliga I think Champions League all on my phone all they're not HD but they're close enough all on my phone Dude, this is like, honestly, this is like game changing. I live in Canada. You guys need to realize that we are so deprived of proper footy sports coverage. We don't get it. We literally pay these insane prices for these premium footy channels that are all garbage. Where you get nothing nice and special. So I have that, which has put me into an absolutely incredibly good mood. Um, Johnny, thank you for the resub, dude. So I'm ready to get right into today's episode. If you guys are excited for today's episode, I don't know what the hell the title is. I don't know what the thumbnail is because I don't even know what I'm going to do. I have a few things here that I would like to do. Bob, thank you so much for the first time sub as well. I love you, dude. Welcome to the family. Two things I want to do here. First of all, a couple of my players have gone up in price. So I don't know if I'm going to make this move today. I want to hear from you guys what you would like to see from me. I've made about 30 to 40,000 coins, maybe even 50,000. No, I think it's about 30 to 40,000 coins on Freddy Guarian's Inform. Um, I've now made about 5k on Hamshik as of this recording. Not much that I've made on Biglia. I think since I played with him um, and told you guys he was okay. He's not incredible, but for his price, he's good. He's gone up about 5k. Higuain's gone up a little bit. Uh, another, you know, 10, 20k maybe. So I'm sitting on, I think... If I were to cash all of this out, Ben Yedder's gone up in price as well. I'm sitting on about 400 to 450,000 coins, give or take the tax loss and stuff like that. Now, why I'm thinking of cashing out, and I might start cashing out today, but I want to see what you guys say in the comments. Because even though I do record this stuff live, it is meant for YouTube. As much as my stream loves this series, as much as my YouTube viewers, this is meant for YouTube. This is for you guys on YouTube. So... I want to see in the comments down below if you guys are cool with me cashing everything out and then trying to snag either a legend to then build an overpowered cheap team around or try and buy myself a team of the year, maybe even fresh, to then build an overpowered cheap team around. It's not going to be the forwards, but I would love to try and purchase someone that would be would have more of an effect on the play. So whether it's the center backs, wing backs, Midfielders, can I snag a Luka Modric maybe? I, I don't know. But you guys let me know in the comments down below. If you want me to do that, just say yes. If you want it, I guess show me another way. You can smash the shit out of the like button if you want me to cash out the team and hunt down a really good legend or a really good team of the year. If we get like over five or 6,000 likes, because usually these videos get two to 3,000 likes. If we double the likes on this video, I'll know you guys want me to do that. So for the time being, I'm going to keep this team. It is a weekend upload, so I will be doing a FUT draft, and I think we're going to get right into it. I've got enough, you know, coins uh, to burn, and I've been confident in my gameplay lately. Um, I've been struggling to, in divisions. Oh, no. Oh, God. This isn't going to help me out. Uh, do I do three at the back? Do I do three at the back? Considering how much possession I hold anyways... Do I do? I could do 4 1 2 1 2, but then I'd be using like Ronaldo and Messi at left. Oh no, this is 4 1 2 1 2 with the center mids. I really want to use this formation, but it means I'm very limited to the forwards that I want to use. Oh, so what do we do here? Same thing here. If I got five at the back with wingers, I think I would have went five at the back. Five at the back is so dirty. I'm actually tempted to go with three, four, one, two. I can't, four, one, two, and two just means I can't use any of the wingers I want, boys. You know that I'm going to try and put together a BBVA setup. You know I'm going to do it. And putting a BBVA setup is either going to be three, four, two, one, which is a pretty bad formation, um, or three, four, one, two. Hmm. Everyone wants me to do four, one, two, and two. I realize that. 
But there's no left mids and right mids. There's no left mids and right I mean, three. you know what? Three, four, two, one. We could fit, like, if we get them, Bale, Messi, Neymar, and Ronaldo all in a team. Now, is that going to happen? Probably not. But the possibility is there. And then with a formation like this, I'm just going to have to try and score more goals than my opponents. I'll leak goals like crazy. Um, 4 4 2 flat is also a very overpowered formation, actually. So for me right now, believe it or not, it's between 3 4 2 1, where we could just have an incredible amount of really high rated players, or we go with a formation that is still very good. Um, and we can also use Ronaldo and stuff like that if we get him and Messi, you know? And then we just have to like build up the play to get Ronaldo and Messi or Bale and Neymar, or whoever involved in the game. Do I go with 4 4 2 flat? I haven't even used 4-4-2 this year, so that could... Oh, even though I want to build, like, the highest rated team, I think we're going to go with 4-4-2 flat. I think we're going to go with 4-4-2 flat. All right, come on. We getting blues? Gotta love when you start a FUT draft and you get the best player in the game. Now, I'm sure 90% of people that start their FUT drafts get a Leo Messi. But I am so down with that, man. I am so down with that. So, Ronaldo, we'll hope that we get a higher rated version of Ronaldo later on. Hmm. You just got to. You just got to. You got to go with Messi, and then you got to skip this song, because this song is so bad. Much better. Much better. Okay. So, what do we do here? Do we go with the strikers? Do we jump with the strikers? So, I mean, the dream would be Benzema and Suarez together. That would be lovely. All right, let's go with the left striker. Come on. 90, I've never, I know he has a 95 rated card. I've never got a 94 rated Suarez in a draft ever. Perfect. In before Nick gets knocked out first round. Oh, that's such a good looking card. Makes me miss my Ebro, man. Okay. Um. So my worry is I don't want to, I don't want to get the like five shitty players. You know what I mean? But I'm going to go with the, the right striker. And there you go. We got the five shitty players. <laughs> oh, no. This guy actually looks like he... Well, I don't have... I don't have Spanish players. So I don't know how this is going to work. Is he left-footed or right-footed? He's got the pace. Horrific passing, though. This is really... The, oh, yeah, well, it's happened. Okay. So, fingers crossed we don't get more garbage. Time being, that's going to be a little bit better. All right. So, I don't have to go BBVA. I could go, I could go two, you know, two-sided route if I wanted to. All right. So, Hazard or, this is the third in form Sanchez, isn't it? Who's a really good card, by the way. Costa's really good, too. I think BPL is going to be slightly easier to put together. And then Sanchez would be a good super sub. Although, I'd like to try out Costa. He's also left-footed. I'm going to go Sanchez. Okay. Now... Come on, Nick. Don't botch this, dude. Do not botch this. Oh, why? Por que? Why are you doing this, EA? All right, we'll go with him. Um, he's actually a pretty damn good card. He's Belgian as well. And we can link him up at least with Sanchez. Oh my god, this is falling apart, boys. I'm going to go with my center mids, and then I'm going to actually start bringing in substitutes here. Dude, it's, it's almost forcing me to put together a... Um, it's almost forcing me to get... Oh, man. It's almost forcing me to do a BPL side, which isn't terrible. Oh, that's not terrible. All right, let's try some. Uh, let's try some. Let's try some subs here. Let's try some subs. Okay, so we did get a BBVA striker. Never thought I would even use someone by the name of Sanabria, but he's not terrible, is he? Definitely not terrible, and I think he's the most usable out of everyone. Carlos Vela is a good card, but not someone that's going to uh, get into the team. Okay. God, I, it started with so much promise with Suarez and uh, and Messi. Mm. Do we start doing the defenders as well and seeing what we get out of this? What do you guys think? Seeing if we get any midfielders or something like that. One half BPL, one half BBVA is kind of the kind of the aim here, isn't it? All right, let's uh, let's see. Let's see if the left back. Oh, you bastards! See, they do this all the time. So see, we get. I'm gonna go. So I'm either going to pick. This is kind of the the theme of this. Is I'm either going to pick 
BBVA or BPL when the choice is there. And then we'll kind of try and try and fit it all together. All right, come on. So what are we doing? BPL or BBV? Okay. Oh my. I really like this card. As much as I liked Laporte a lot, this card blew me away when I used it uh, the first time. So I think I'm going to go with Bartra. Good, good. Okay. So now, now we're back to the BBVA. EA doesn't know what they want to give us. Oh, and now we're back to the BPL. Okay. So I've got, I've got, I've got Shiny. I've got Fonte. Fonte is what? Medium high work rates, right footed. Mangala is pretty damn OP and he's left footed, man. You know what? A Mangala. Ooh. And Mangala, I've got like the French links with like Benoit Tremouline. I've got like Gael Clichy. So I think, I think Mangala is definitely a better choice than going just with the 82 rated Fonte, I think. I think we go Mangala and then just flippity flop things around. Okay. All right. Come on. Team of the Year Alves. Okay. Not bad though. Um, I want to go with Danilo, but at least Arbeloa gets a strong link to, to Bartra. Right? Would that be the better play? Danilo is so much better than him though. Medium, medium, six feet tall. So you've got that, or you've got that. Hmm. Danilo is better, though. He is better. I'm going to go Danilo. You know what? Bartra off of Kemba with someone a little bit better at right back, I think is going to be helpful. Okay. Um. All right. I'm, I, I actually don't want to go with this goalkeeper yet. Let's let's try the goalkeeper over here. See what we get. So BPL, BBVA. Good Lord. Good Lord. Neither. Rufier at least gets a soft link to Mangala. Marshall is useless. He was in the Premier League last year, wasn't he? It's going to have to be Rufier. At least he'll get seven or eight. Seven or eight chems on the end of the world. Um, all right. Before I pick the goalkeeper, I want to see what type of other players I can get. So at this point, we're looking for like a BBVA center mid. Uh, Premier League left back. So let's look at, let's look at defenders first. Come on. Thanks. Thanks. Thanks a lot, EA. None of that helps me. I need him. I need I need the inform Vanderveel for my main account. I could you know what? Martinez is actually a good play, isn't it? No, it isn't. Well, it'll link up the defense at least. Oh god. I actually think Martinez is really the only semi-usable option right now. I don't really want him, but. There we go. We went up a few chem. Okay. This ain't, this ain't gonna be easy. Okay. Alright. Come on. Come on. What in the hell, man? What are these... Siri, uh... So, could go with a Frenchman. High, high work rates is terrible. Dan gets me... So... Hmm... So I've got the three Frenchmen at center back that I could use. Not exactly what I wanted to do. Oh god, these, this is terrible. Alright, let's see what we get here. So, Spanish, BBVA, French, or... So I guess we go BBVA. Do we go with Kameni or do we go with Carrasco? Oh, this is... This is falling apart, dudes! French, Carrasco, it at least would link up with those other two. That means Bartra gets taken out of the team, or... Or, or, or I put Bartra into the midfield and he'll link with Messi and Suarez. And at least Messi and Suarez will be on chem. Although, Messi and Suarez are already on chem, aren't they? Yeah, they're both on full chem right now anyways. Hmm. I think we go Kemeni. Kemeni is terrible, though. He is really bad. Like, I, I, don't, I don't like using him at all, man. Carrasco looks like he'd be decent, but then I'd be forced to use a French backline. Yeah, that's the tough part. It's like Carrasco's better, but I've, I'd have to use not the greatest center backs. Um, although Rufier is better than Carrasco anyways, isn't he? Let's go with Kameni. I've got Rufier if I need him. Okay. So at this point, I'm looking for... Really, I'm looking for BBVA everything. Like, a BBVA center back would be nice, um, you know, to just get rid of this. And BBVA midfielders, yeah, that, that that's just what I'm doing, isn't it? BBVA everything. And we get... We get... BBVA nothing! We got Son though. 
Nice card. Nice substitution to have. Um, Vitzel. We've got Oscar. Oscar's slightly better than... I think we go Oscar, don't we? I go down. Yeah, I go down a chem, don't I? Three-star weak foot. Three-star weak foot. High, high work rates. He's medium high, right? Okay. It's pretty bad. I'm surprised the chem is so bad, though. Who's that much? Oh. Oh, yeah. Okay, never mind. Schweinsteiger's is severely off a of chem. Yo, a Mustafi would be perfect. It would allow me to actually keep Schweinsteiger uh, in the team as well. Yo, give me a Mustafi at some point. Okay. Um. Oh, we get the super link. We get the super link here out of this. We get the super link here. Man, this is not EA is EA is not making this this easy on me at all. Okay. I think I do this then. Up five. Yeah, that's better. That's actually you know what? That would probably be a pretty damn good midfield, wouldn't it be? What's his weak foot? He's a three-star weak foot as well. Yeah, Ramirez, you just you gotta go. I don't know. I feel like you gotta go Ramirez. Tiago would have got a strong link here. I agree with that. But he doesn't add anything out. Oh, Tiago would have got a strong link. If I moved over Bartra, that could have worked as well. Yeah, Tiago or Ramirez. I think those are the two choices that I had. Um, all right, come on. Oh, there he is. Oh, my God. What do we do now? This is a tough one. Benzema goes to left striker. That's his best card. Cristiano goes to left wing. Oh, man. And then Sanchez becomes a super sub. Oh, man. I mean, I almost have to go with Ronaldo. Team of the Year, I, I have to. I would be an absolute tit if I didn't pick Team of the Year Ronaldo. I have to. Sanchez will be a super sub. Um, 85. You gotta! You gotta! You gotta go Ronaldo, man. You gotta go Ronaldo. I know a lot of people are gonna say Benzema, but you gotta. Ronaldo Messi cutting in. Medium high as well, so I can maybe try and get Oscar and Ramirez to stay back. Um, he's got Shadow Chem style on him as well, so I think this is going to work out. I do think this is going to work out. I'm actually slightly surprised still that the chemistry is so awful. Alright, so we're looking for like Benzema. Someone up, up front at striker would be better. A left back that would give Ronaldo a strong link. Well, Marcelo would be really nice. And then maybe BBVA midfielders. That's really the that's what we're looking for. Striker left back and maybe center mids. You know, Ramirez and Oscar can be super subs at uh, at a certain point. Oh, you bastards. Oh my god, what do we do here? I'm thinking Neymar left wing. No shit. Neymar I can put him up front, can't I? Oh, what would be the better play, boys? I was thinking Neymar left wing because he would get a link with Oscar and Ramirez. And then put Ronaldo at striker. Ronaldo off of Cam at striker is still going to be incredible. I think we do Neymar. Even though I'm, even though I kind of want the team of the year Neymar, I think we got to do Neymar, don't we? Mario Gaspar. What's his height? Six foot. I could put Mario Gaspar at center back as well, actually. Bale at striker. Could do Bale at striker. Could do Bale at striker because he's going to be off Cam anyways, and he gives. That's a good point. Could do Bale at striker. Um, he'll be off of Kem. No matter who, what winger I put at striker will be off of Kem. And at least he'll give Ronaldo full Kem. That's a great, that's a great idea. The Mighty Cal, thank you for the resub, dude. That's a great idea, boys. I think actually that's the best option, isn't it? Bale at center mid. He'd be off of Kem there as well. We could use Bale at center mid too. Yeah, I guess Bale is the best option though. I've gone down a Kem? I've gone down one Kem, but at least Ronaldo's on Kem. Okay. 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 There's still there's still a possibility to get a lot out of this. All right. So now we're looking, I think, for BBVA midfielders and a center back. That's what we're looking for. BBVA midfielders and a BBVA center back. We're trying to push this into a full BBVA setup, which EA will just not allow us to do. God damn. Now we got William for another super link. Pandanovic would be a good super sub goalkeeper. Although you guys have told me both on Twitter and even in my comments that Pandanovic is terrible. When I wanted to try and buy him for uh, the divisions team that we have on this account. 
Uh, Willian as a super sub. Valbuena could be a super sub. Not many good options here, dudes. This guy's a beast, so I could use him as a defensive super sub. Um, mm -mm -mm. Try calling me a mug saying Neymar would have linked with Oscar, but Ronaldo would have still been off of Kem. So it's, 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 you know, a little bit of this, a little bit of that. You can calm down, man. You know, freaking out at me for picking something that would have just resulted in the same chemistry. One player still having worse chem and someone getting better chem versus the other way around. Calm down, man. Go get your, like, dick sucked or something, buddy. You, you seem to be a little bit too stressed. Um, I don't know. Mm, I don't know what, I don't know what to choose out of this, man. Now, see, if I, I, not, I wouldn't, Pereira wouldn't go in the team. He wouldn't fit in the team, unfortunately. Ronaldo's already on chem, so he doesn't, yeah, he doesn't need to go in the team. At this point, it's, we're looking at a sub. So, man, uh, do we go Willian? I'm not taking Messi off. That's not happening. But I think Willian would be a, yeah, I think Willian, I think Willian would be, I think Willian would be a good sub here. <clears throat> Perfect. All right. I, I'm not taking Messi off, man. I'm not taking Messi off. Could flip, could flippity flop, nah. So what are we at? 84 chem, right? What were we at originally? 84. So uh, that actually didn't change a damn thing. What the hell? Okay. All right, still looking for BBVA players though. Oh my God, Neymar now too. Oh Lord. Oh Gaia. Damn it, and that doesn't really help me out. Oh God, what do we do? <laughs> what the hell do we do? If I go Neymar, we can then put Ronaldo up front. We can then put Ronaldo up front. That doesn't do anything though, does it? If I go with Neymar, that doesn't change anything at all, right? Neymar at left wing would connect with Oscar. Oh wait, Oscar would get full chem because of this, right? Neymar left wing, Ronaldo at striker with Suarez. And then, and then Bale would just be a super sub at that point. Go with, we could go, Gaia at center back? Gaia at center back. Five foot seven. Gaia at center back. What the fuck? No stream. Uh, okay. Um, I'm going to do this. I'm going to do, so we're up to 86 chem. That doesn't change anything. Okay, that is an option. If I get another BBVA mid, Bale could go into, could go at, if I get like, oh, the dream would be to get a Spanish center mid here and then I could put Bale here. That would be nice. That would link up pretty much everything then. Okay, come on, come on, come on, come on. Spanish center mid from the BBVA, please. <laughs> uh, what? I'm sorry. What the hell? Okay, so none of this, none of this helps. None of this helps at all. All right, come on. Oh, EA Sports. You had one job. Give me just one BBVA mid. Wow, man. I had, there was so much promise. So much promise for this team. Bale would be a great center mid. Bale is a great center mid. Trust me, I can confirm it. Nep, Nep uses Bale at center mid. I use Bale at center mid. Um, obviously, in my main accounts, I can swap him around. Ew. Um, yeah, I'm, I'm screwed. I'm screwed. I actually don't know what to do here. I think it's just better if I did this, honestly. I think it is better if I did this. 86 chem. Eighty one chem. Eighty seven chem. Now we're using Danilo. Oh, he's six feet tall. Yo, that <laughs> that's not horrible, is it? Oh, Ronaldo's on two chem. How can I get Ronaldo up? Really? Huh. I can't.
can't. Okay, I can't get Ronaldo up on cam. Wow, God, Ronaldo's on two cam. That's so bad. <laughs> this team is. This is the worst team I think I've ever put together ever. Oh my God. <laughs> um. Crazy, crazy how bad the chem drops, hey? Am I seriously, am I seriously going to do this? Am I actually going to do this? Am I actually going to do this? Oh my lord, um... Bale on 3 chem, Ronaldo on 2 chem. Oh my... Yeah, I, of course. I mean, we could do this, right? This gets us up to 92 cam. I guess we could just use Ronaldo as a super sub. I kind of wanted Ronaldo just to start. Um... What the fuck? Bale is a center back? Oh! <gasps> This is actually not terrible, is it? Ew, on 3 chem though. I just went up chem by by taking away chem from Ramirez. Seems like an odd odd way to go about things. Really, really odd way to go about things. Um Yeah, but like so my I can I could just go ahead and start taking out players left and right. 97 chem. Um, could do that. Could do that. Could start. I mean, the team now looks like shit, but we're at 97 chem. So there's the question is go with like a full setup of players that, that are going to help us win right from the get go, but are on worse chem or, or go for chemistry. That's the question. Go for higher rated players in the team. Messi. Yeah, well, really, namely Messi in the team. Um, so we went from 97 chem. It's just... So the, my reasoning here is it's one less sub to worry about. You know what I mean? Instead of bringing on Messi and Ronaldo right away, Messi's already in the team. You know, I'll probably sub on Ronaldo instantly at striker. Probably flop him and Suarez around. Who has better passing stats here? Yeah. So I would put Ronaldo at right striker... Uh, Wait, what? Sorry. Hold on a second. Okay, yeah. Neymar doesn't need the link. Neymar doesn't need the link. Messi does need the link. Okay. So I actually go down in chem. Bale's six feet. Uh, okay. Hmm. I wonder who would actually play better here, though. This is so funny, I can't decide. Um, Alright, I'm gonna, I'm actually going to do this. This is crazy, I know, but I'm actually going to do this. Um, God, the team's rating is 87 as well. That seems, seems a little bit much. Alright. So we're looking for who needs the chemistry. Oh, wow. Um, yeah, I don't think, I, I don't think there even is a Paraguay. Paraguayan? Paraguay coach, but Brazil, Paraguay, Wales, Brazil, Paraguay, and Wales. Those are the three coaches we're looking for. Or or BPL in like Wales would be the dream, wouldn't it? All right, see what you got for me, EA. Okay, so we've got BPL takes me up by two, takes me up by two. That takes me up by three. Ooh. Yeah, I guess we go Brazil. I guess we go Brazil, because Ronaldo's not even... Yeah. All right. Not bad. Not bad. Leo Messi, Sanchez, Martinez. Okay. Squad is actually 183. Let's have a quick look at my draft history as well. I've only won three out of 15 attempts. And unfortunately, this type of a squad is not going to help me do it. It really isn't. The funny thing is, on paper, if you look away from the chem, 
minus, you know, Sanabria, this team is actually pretty damn good. It really is. Like, Bale, I know that seems crazy to you guys, but he's not going to be terrible. I'd love to be able to swap him and Bart. Like, I'd love to start like that. How much chem did I lose by doing that? Wow, I lost four chem by doing that. That's crazy. Um, yeah, I'd, lo I'd, lo I'd love to start. Like, I'd love to play the game. Like, well, why not? I guess I could just swap them around. Not the end of the world. All right, well, wish me luck. This is going to be rough. All right, first game of the day. Oh, oh the draft. Oh, the draft. All right, my plebs rolling up against this five at the back. Equally awesome team in terms of its personnel, but it also has way better chemistry. I actually changed my team around a little bit, and I put Bale in the midfield, so it means my chemistry is even worse. Oh, God. I hate the draft. First game of the day, too. I shouldn't be playing my first game of the day um, in, like, a must-win draft game. Okay. Here we go. Is that... For fuck's sakes. Dude, my team is so attacking. I I'd be shocked if I didn't get hit on about 17 different counterattacks uh, in this game. Because my, my whole, like, front six... Or, you know, front two and then my midfield all just push up the field like lunatics. Oh, this is good. This is great! Yes, boys! There it is! This just nonsensical, idiotic team is actually playing very good right now. Very attacking. So I need to make the most of my chances. That's probably the second or third chance we've had. I don't know if I'm going to show you guys all the other chances. Because I'm hoping we play a lot of games in this episode considering it took me what 25 minutes to build that damn foot draft i owe you guys a bunch of games so even if we get knocked out in the draft we'll play a lot of divisions games that's mine no no one's doing anything right now is he sweating it yes bartra manual defending op here we go okay somehow Oh, Gaia! Here we go. Bale to Ronaldo. Ronaldo cut inside. Back to Bale. That's a foul, ref! <sighs> ref, there's so many fouls going on! You haven't called a single one! Are you insane? Oh! What? What?! I'm sorry, what the hell was that?! Well, 1-1, one, one, man. And this is why I hate the FUD draft. As you guys already know, perfect example as to why I hate the FUD draft. About seven tackles there that the ref didn't call anything as a foul. And then a through ball that makes no sense gets right through the middle of the park. And who are my center backs right now? I think it's Martinez and Bartra. So it's not like they're terrible center backs. What the hell? Hmm. Oh, the draft! Two shots on goal. Instantly one after another. That's a great goal by Ronaldo, but like, oh, wow, man. Just honestly, oh, this series has gone to shit, man. I don't even enjoy the poor man Road to Glory anymore. I gotta say, I don't enjoy this, this shit anymore. I don't. This series might get canceled, honestly. Like, I just, uh, I might just keep this series to my streams. Like, I don't know if I'm going to upload, because I'm not even fucking having fun anymore, man. Like, just suck yourself, EA. You never get rewarded for, like, holding possession, you know? You get rewarded for just fouling people, man. That's all you get rewarded for. And yes, I'm being a big baby, alright? Allow it. Uh, I'm going to try and take this free kick here, though. Come on. Come on, who's on this? Leo? It's a weird angle. I'm going to... Uh... Holy crap, Suarez has those incredible stats, though. Let's try Suarez. Come on, Suarez. Come on, Suarez. Wow. That's good, though. That's good. That's good! What happened? Oh my god, it was just a terrible pass! Or terrible shot! That's all it is! Oh lord, man! That needed to be powered, didn't it? That was pretty good, actually. I was really proud of that build-up. Come on, man. What are you even doing, buddy? Ten minutes. I need to go on attacking. See if that gives me uh, some better opportunities. Okay. 
don't know what I'm up, up again. Come on, Ramirez. Come on, Ramirez. Just got beasted by Mangala. There we go. Ronaldo! Oh my god! There it is! There it is, boys! Out of absolutely nothing. Don't even take a touch. Just let it bounce in front of me. Hit it on the volley. Team of the year, Ronaldo. I honestly can tell you guys right now. I, I think you've been... I mean, I'm going to show you until the end of the, uh, of the half. This full replay from 74 minutes on. But honestly, I don't deserve it. I don't deserve it. At all. Um, this guy's been good. He's held possession. He's done everything right in terms of pissing me off. Uh, by like just holding on to the ball, being super patient. The fact that I scored that out of absolutely nothing. Here we go. It doesn't mean I'm even gonna get into. I'm, it doesn't even mean I'm gonna get into extra time. Well, there you go. You know what? It's all good. It's all good. I don't deserve it, anyways. I'm doing my best to not rage. There we go. The scoreline goes back to exactly how it should be. What even is that defending from my team, man? Oh, God. Come on, Ronaldo. Make a run, Ronaldo. So there we go. Man doesn't even get into extra time. Good one, Nick. This is, this is, so stuff like this, this is what he's done the entire game. I mean, at least he's pushing up the field right now. It's as if he can hear me talking about him. Because all he's been doing is pushing it around the back. Oh, man. R.I.P. I can't believe that. Score, and then he just walks up the field, bounces through Mangala's tackle. That pass, man. Ref! Ref, I beg of you to just let me push on for the final attack. Oh! There you go, dudes! There you go. I don't know how Ronaldo missed that. That was such a good chance as well early on in the game. Modric gets his man of the match. You know what, man? I'm, 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 I'm. I can't wait to read the comments. It's just, it's just gonna be all, uh, all, all hate, all hate, endless amounts of hate. Um, but I didn't really deserve that. I can't even get mad. Whether it was the first round or the final, I didn't deserve that. Um, was it a waste of fifteen thousand coins? Well, we don't know yet, but most likely. <laughs> most likely, it was a waste of fifteen thousand coins. So let's have a look here. First round exit. I'm assuming, do we even get a gold pack? We get two gold packs and a loan pack. All right, so we'll start with the loan pack, see what we get. Looks like we're playing with the Serie A team, boys. Oh God, the rage is just gonna compound. Um, wow, and we get Arteta, lovely. Cannavaro, oh, 300 coins, maybe he'll sell, probably not. Um, Arteta I'll keep for the time being, anyways. Um, you know, he might, he might fit into a team down the road. Not like he's gonna cost me anything. All right, two rares. Like I said, I, I didn't, I didn't really deserve that game. Um, so I, I'm just gonna be a man about it and accept the loss, uh, and see if we can milk these packs for what they're worth. So, uh, all of these guys may sell. Uh, they probably won't, will they? Um, let's just list up. Okay, I'm gonna keep this. Uh, that's an interesting kit, actually. I might, I might, you know what? West Ham third kit. I might keep this. Get rid of the uh get rid of the uh the West Ham kit. And thank you for all the subs and stuff, boys. I'll give you guys proper shoutouts in a few seconds here. Uh so I'll sell all this stuff. Maybe I'll just sell it on my own time. Gladiator I could use. It's actually a pretty good chem style. So there we go. We got a thousand coins so far back from our initial 15,000 coin money lit on fire investment. And we end with. Hmm. Nice. Oh wow, that guy went to real real salt lake? Really? I think this is a new transfer. Okay. I don't know if we'll get anything for him, but he is a new transfer, so we may get something for him. Um, that, 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 I'll sell on later. Uh, these sell for 1,200. Wow, so we have lost about 12,000 coins out of that foot draft. I mean, no surprises, really. I mean, how, how do I expect to get anything out of it if I can't even make it out of the first round? Yeah, yeah, we've lost about 12,000 coins there. Okay, so, I think we're going to use the main squad here in divisions. God help me. Because I think at this point we're going to get relegated out of Div 3, aren't we? Um, I'm going to keep the team as is. But, like, if you guys choose 
for me to keep using this team, I might move my investment into the middle and use him as a center attacking mid and then get just another defensive center mid, like a, I don't know, a, a De Jong. I might sell this guy on as well and just get Daniele De Rossi and then use the team like that. Maybe try and build up and save for inform Kandreva. Anyways, let's get into the second game of the episode, but first game in divisions. And to show you guys as well, let me, let me, let me quickly show you guys here. This is, this is the predicament that we, this is the predicament that we have in division three. 1-0-4. Oh, so I need to win three of my next five games just to stay in the division. Or the next five games to get promoted, which is not going to happen knowing how bad I've been playing FIFA the last few days. But see how we can do. I just wanted to ask you that. No, you can. You're you're more than welcome to be in the recordings, dude. I don't I don't mind. I'm playing. I'm gameplay divisions right now. So if you want to you want to try and get in my head, you're welcome to. I'm in a, I'm in an okay mood. Wow, this guy's using you David Luiz. You can play this game and then I'll I'll jump in and annoy the fuck out of you. All right. Well, this guy's ask, using this guy's yeah. fucking using David Luiz at striker. So good, you're I'll, not gonna Nick, be. Nick, if you here. don't beat this guy, yeah. If you don't beat this guy, just free at the back. I didn't even see David Luiz at striker. He's messy. What is he doing? <laughs> I don't know, but dude, that that team actually looks good. All right, so you'll be back in 20 minutes then. Yeah, yeah, I just want to do a card of myself. Okay, <laughs> like, I'm gonna watch that out of curiosity because if you lose, I will be fucking in the hysterics. Okay. All right. Bye. Bye. Oh. Oh! 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 Too much! Oh! Ah! Yeah! Oh man! Yes! Still got the ball! Still got the ball! Green! Oh! I needed to get the shot off there. That was really good. That was really, really good. There we go. Still got the pressure going. I like this. Great! That's such a bad pass. Still pressure on him though. Guarine. Okay. Terrible touch, but that was probably because of how... What the hell is happening? Ref foul. Ref foul. That was a foul. Just just to fill you in there, that was a full bore, all-out foul. Anyways. Okay. FIFA, please. FIFA, please. Please, can you just work? Hamshik, you god! Off the post. He just saved it off the post. That was such a good play. Oh, man. So much pressure. Again, as always, right? Pressure, possession, shots, no goals. Nick 28T's FIFA 16 experience for the last week in a nutshell. All right. This is basically this guy's first push up the field. Let's see what he does. Oh, God. Bit of lag to help him out. Yes, yeah, Sabate, you king. No worries. That's, that's what a lot of people would consider a foul, ref. Don't EA, please. Oh, my God. You know when Bateson said I shouldn't play FIFA at all today because it's awful? Should have listened to him. Should have, should have just, I should have just uploaded like Barbie's Dream House or something to YouTube. I think more people would have enjoyed watching me play that than this and me rage. One nothing down. Seems about right, man. Seems about right. Seems about right, boys. Oh, two goals. Two shots. Two goals. No. No. David Luiz just scored. Is this a prank, bro? Is this just a prank? Like, are EA devs, like, purposely doing all of this shit to my accounts? Like, just to have a little bit of fun? Is, is that what's happening? Is that what's happening? Or... Have in in six days have I gone from a div one winner and I'm not gonna I'm gonna I'm gonna give myself a bit of credit here a div one crusher a div yeah I, I had a feeling you would join the call again basically. wait what Nick David Luiz just scored again <laughs> <laughs> Bateson in six days I've horrible. gone from a div one winner to a guy that concedes goals in division three to David Luiz that's what I happened. thought this guy would potentially go into the game. Piss around with the ball for a little bit, and then back out. But he's actually dominating you. Yeah, what? Luis, you know what? Gone. For he's the sake of this back. video, for the sake of this video, I'm going to show all of the gameplay. I'm not going to edit anything. Yeah. There's no domination here. Those are two shots on net now that he scored on. I'm just bad, dude. I'm just bad. That I'm not going to come up with an excuse for that. That was good. He's like, he's like Eber with hair. Yeah, he is. Well, with puffy hair. 
I was I just said it in the video and I clicked back and I saw uh, David Luiz goal. Like, what? He just, doing, just did a skill move against me, dude. I can't even be mad, honestly. I can't. Like this is his. This is fucking funny at this point. Like I, I can't even be angry. I'm well, losing it, it's one of it's one of them. It's your world to glory. And if you got to prove that you're the best, so what you need to do now is get your air game on, fully concentrate, yep. not laugh at the fact that David Luiz has scored and yep. Rabiot, who's also a low-rated player, scored yep. against you. Yeah, he did. And, he did. and dominate. Yep. And yes, uh, do, do you want to know something? Yes, I do. To make you a little bit happier, yeah. in your road to glory, don't sell Higuain. Why? Oh, because he's going to get an upgrade, isn't he? Yeah, he. I've just been looking around the upgrades. Who else have you got in phone wise, Nick? Uh, I got Inform Guarine that's gone up about 40k since I bought him. Uh, yeah, because so because like Guarine. does Guarine play for Inter? Inter, yeah. He won't get an upgrade, but oh, he won't get an upgrade because he's just left. Yes. Yes, Bateson. Two one. I also hit the post. All right, stay in the call, Bateson. You're my you're my okay. life coach right now. And I'm doing dance moves with Quadrado. Okay, two one. Here we go. Yeah, I got, I got, uh, I got, I got Freddie Guarin. Um, I got Inform Biglia, but he's not that great, dude. I made a few coins on him, but he's not really that good. Um, Have you got Insigne? Lorenzo Insigne? No, I was thinking of buying him too. I think his price has gone up now. He's getting a skill upgrade to four star skills. Oh no! And his informs him at like 84 rated. He really? gains 86 base card. So that informer you've got is an 86, yeah. an 87. 87. So he's going to be what, might, like an 89? It could be, a, yeah, if he gets one, it could be an 89, 90 rated to fucking inform. That's oh, crazy, dude. Yeah. Okay, I got to concentrate here. I'm going to concede again. I just 3-1. Dude, I'm fucking, I am so bad. Oh, I've so got Ben Yedder as well, but Ben Yedder I don't think is going to get an upgrade. Um, yeah. I do have informed Ben Yedder. That's a great goal. I just got, wow. Wow. Abate just Shit, got nutmegged. Oh, uh, yeah, this is, uh, that's bad defending. Yeah, you say you won Division 1? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> I almost won it twice in one day, too, which is so shit. Now I can't, I can't... Like I said, I can't... I'm a sieve. I just leak goals left and right. That's all I do. Here we go. Who's Ben Yedder play for? Wow. Wow. And then there's that shot. Ben Yedder plays for... Oh, Raf. Uh, League F side. I'm trying to think of who. Oh, there um, he is. Toulouse? Is it? Yeah, he's not getting up great. He's 78 no. rated still. There are the stats. Pretty much equal possession, equal pass accuracy, equal shots. Only difference is he's got three shots on target, three goals. I have three shots on target, one goal because I'm bad. Um, all right, I'm going to change things up. I'm going to push Gorin up the field like this. I'm going to push Hamsik, Hamshik here. Biglia is going to be my CD, my like just dedicated CDM. And then I'm going to bring on Yannick Bolasi as a super sub for Perisic. Because Perisic is just too slow. All right. Let's see how we do here. Come on. Full games OP. Uh-oh. Uh -oh. What's going on here? There it is. Come on. Come on, Nick. You can't lose to, to this type of a team. It's just, it's not allowed. You in Division 3 as well. I'm no, not, so. I'm not, I won't be in Division 3 for long, Bateson. I'm going to get relegated, dude. This is five. Yeah, this is five losses in Div Three. If if this if this keeps up, five losses, five losses. I don't even lose that many games in fucking Division One. No, you do. No, I don't. I swear. Division One. I, my my, my, my biggest curse. Like I know I know you're trolling, but my biggest curse in Division One is I draw games like crazy. Like I leak goals right at the end for someone to you know to get a two two draw or some shit. Yeah. Come on, man. But like this, I'm just getting fisted left and right. And it's not that I'm it's using bad teams. Two. What's that? No, no one plays 3-5-2. It's really weird how he's playing 3-5-2 and doing all right of it Look, as well. he's being an asshole now, passing it around the back. This is cool. Oh, you disconnect? Oh, that would be perfect karma if you disconnected, bro. Can I just get? Can I just make it 1-1, one, one, EA? Can you just make it 1-1? One, one? It's 3-1. Look at that. Uh, yeah, sorry. 3-3. Three, three. I don't know. I don't know what I'm saying, dude. I'm so confused. Offside. That was very offside, but that was a good cross. Come on. Look at this. Look at this. Like, I've got a good team, too. So to all the people saying, oh, you can only win with good teams, not bad teams. This is a fucking good team! This has nothing to do with it! Come on, Higuain. Keep that run going. No. Shit run. Fuck's sakes. Yeah, this is a good team. So, yeah, I, I mean... If I base are it off playing, of... Are you playing through the center against him? Yeah, I am. I don't know what else yeah, to good. do. Go down the wings. 3 5 is well open down the wings. That's a good point. Here we go. All right. 
Okay. Big Leon. Here we go. Abate. That's, I mean, the idea was there. The cross. Not the greatest. Dude. This guy is David Luiz. Is beasting me and then sending, like, beautiful runs for his Martial to run in on net. What is happening here? Oh, my God. That's a great tackle from Manolas, though. Here we go. Okay. Here we go. Of course, Koscielny gets a block in. That was such a good play, too. I need to go on attacking. I have to. No, no, you don't. Uh, dude, 63rd minute. Come on. Come on. There we go. Abate, pick it up. Manolas fucked up the pass. Fuck, dude. I'm pushing. I'm forcing it way too much, man. Way, way too much. What in the fuck? Oh my god! It's really funny, this guy having David Luiz at striker, because he's he covers, like, he covers area so good. So even my, like, center backs, they're just getting tackled by David Luiz over and over again. What is happening? Yeah, he's really aggressive. Yeah. Okay, come on, man. Every time I watch you play FIFA, Nick, it just makes me want to not turn on the console to play FIFA. Uh, right? Like, what a sick Even advertisement. Yeah. What a sick... I, I mean, I, I don't know if that's just me being bad at the game or the game just being AIDS. But, yeah. No, just, I, just, I just don't want to play a game and this type of thing happen to me. That's what I'm saying, dude. And that's what people were telling me during Team of the Year as well. Watching me open thousands of dollars in packs and get no one. People said the same thing. They're like, why? Like, watching your... Watching what you get, why would we ever watch this and want to spend money ourselves? Like, EA have to fix shit to get people wanting to play their game. Because then the people see schmucks like me doing this and get... Oh, that's good. Oh, that's nice. Why is Alexandro? Okay. Big Leah. Oh, that was good too. Too much, man. 74th minute, Bates. This is fucking hopeless. Come on. I might have to go on So if you lose this, you're getting relegated. Mm, no. No, I won't get relegated, but I'll then need to win, I think, all my games. Three or four you games. You might as well go flat attack then. See yeah. what you can do. Yeah, I'll go. I'll go. I mean, a draw won't help either, but better than better than another loss on the record. Here we go. Oh, that would have been nice. Come on, boys. That's mine. Just kidding. Wow. There he is. He's away. I might be offside here. I might get lucky, yeah. Woo! Come on. Come on. Come on. Honestly, man. I don't know. I know this is three at the back, but it feels like he's got about eight at the back right now. Like, the CDMs are right in front of his center backs, and his wingers are dropping deep as well. What a weird formation, man. What I love, too, is this guy is actually... No. Oh, my God, man. Here we go. Here we go. What is that pass, Quadrado? You play so well for me, and then, like, I need a simple little pass. And it's just the worst. Okay, come on. Like, a goal needs to happen right now. Otherwise, I'm done. Wanting out wide doesn't help me out at all. Slide tackle of doom. Please! Oh, Bates in 3 2. 85th minute. Yannick Bolasi, the super sub. Oh! Okay. All right. Composure. That was a little bit lucky. I got a crazy rebound. Let's go. 3 3. Honestly, I'll be okay with a 3 3. Please, 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 please. please, please, please. That was by keeping, by his keeping. Yeah, it's terrible. Like an idiot, too, with Quadrado. I just panicked and I shot it right down the center of the net instead of trying to put it in the corner. But whatever. I'll take a bit of luck. It's a good pass, too. See, I don't know how I feel about ultra-attacking, either, because all it does is push one of my center backs up the field, and then it just makes one of my mids drop and turn into a center back. Like, it doesn't really help out. No, I, I rarely do it. I do it when I'm desperate, yeah. but I've never noticed anything. I've never come back to it. Okay, here we go. Alexandro. Oh my god! Hamshik, you needed to make an... It's over. That needed to be an accurate pass, bro. Okay, I think I have one more. 
It's over. I fucked the pass up. It's done. Oh, man. Honestly, just... Just the worst. Just the worst. Two straight losses. Like, who wants to watch a series like this? Who wants to watch a series like this, man? My goals for the series, Bateson, were to trade up and, like, just invest up and play games up to a million coins. Like, have a million coins in this club. And win Division 1. I don't, I don't know if that's going to happen. What episode number are you? Oh, God. 35 or 36? I've done this from the start of FIFA. I mean, I only play... Like, this This. This account gets, like, anywhere from 5 to 10 games on it played a week. So, it's not a lot of games um, played on it. But I just don't know what to do, man. I don't know what to do from here. I really don't. My player gets man of the match. His team just... I can't believe that David Luiz essentially got the game winner there. <laughs> David Luiz just... Got Oh, all right. So let's have a little look here. If you guys have any suggestions in the comments or in whatever, you know, let me know what you think I should do with the series. I don't, I take back what I said. I know I said I was going to end the series. I was just being a little baby there. Um, but I, I don't know. Like, do I just keep pushing on? Is this just a rough patch? Is it because FIFA's terrible? Or have I just all of a sudden in the last week become absolutely atrocious at FIFA? I don't know what the proper answer is, but unfortunately for you guys, you're only going to get two games for this episode because I need to regroup. I want to see what you guys say in the comments. Should I cash out the team? Bateson's suggestion was to keep Higuain because he may be getting an upgrade, which if he does get an upgrade would mean my 100k spent for Higuain, he might start going for 250 or 300k or something, which would be very nice. A nice yeah. boost to the team. So, I don't know. I might sell everything and just keep Higuain and build like a cheap uh, team with Higuain until until we see his upgrades. Um, but there we are. Five losses in Div 3. Four games left. I, okay, so I need three wins from four games, which we'll be doing next episode. And just deciding whether we cash out this entire team or or keep it for the time being. That's what I can decide. So the goal, as I just said, for the series is a million coins, a Div 1 title... And that's it. And see how we are doing by the end of team of the season or the end of the Euros. What type of players we have in the club and stuff like that. So, I'm going to keep it going. Let me know your thoughts. Bateson, you know what? You're a decent help, actually, for that second game. So, I appreciate it. That's cool. I'm, I'm a nice guy. I'm a yeah, nice you're guy. a great guy, dude. We'll catch you on the flip side. Peace!